Hello guys, my name is Fox and welcome to the first part of our new Crystal Kings 2 Game of Thrones series. So, I've been thinking about who it's gonna be interesting to play as, and I decided that Balen Greyjoy would be an interesting character and a family to play as. Now that I like Balen Greyjoy in the TV series much, but uh, Greyjoys have an uh, interesting raising mechanics and they're becoming independent in the War of the Five Kings and just in general they're in, in the decent place so we're gonna play as well in Greyjoy and I do not have any particular goals for this series but I'm gonna just try to be raiding trying to be declaring wars and expanding and we'll see where we're gonna be able to get from here so yeah let's start the Bell and Greyjoy um okay what do you have in here? Lord Paramount Bellin, I, de uh, I declare that my brother Robert left no trouble issue of his brother, the boy Geoffrey, the Tommen, and Marcella, abominations of incident between Cer Cer Cersei Lannister and Sir Jamie the Kinslayer. So I could accept it, or I could say it all lies. Yeah, I'm gonna accept. He claims, he argues that they're all not looking like their father. Uh, Jamie and Cersei have been having love, as that's uh, known pretty much, and he he's seen the proof of their illegitimacy in the flames. That's a little bit less of a claim, but okay, yeah, of course, of course it's all true. Now, yeah, let's go on and pause and see what we can get from here. The Ironborn have too long lived under the shackles of the men from the Greenlands. It's time we hoist the flag of freedom and live up to the old way. Just in time, my son Theon has returned from the Winter Poison offer. So we have a choice in here of becoming independent and declaring war on King Robert the Young Wolf, the king in the north currently. Or we could do the same but declare war on Tywin, the Lannister. And I've decided that in here we're actually gonna go a little bit uh, ahis ahistorical and not declare war on north. First of all, because I like King because I like Rob, he's just cool, and North is cool, and Starks is cool, and Lannisters are not cool, or they're less cool, at least uh, Tyrion is cool, but the rest of them is not, uh, so we're just gonna declare war on Tywin, and also it's uh, a little bit wiser, because Tywin have a lot more loot for me to take, and that's what we care about, we do not sow, we take what is ours, and we're gonna take all the money from Westeros, or from Westerlands, and also, it's probably gonna help uh, the North to actually win their independence. And it would be interesting to see how it's gonna work out. So, I'm gonna become independent, and we're gonna declare war on Westerlands. So, let's see what we have in here. We are skilled commander, skilled fighter, inspiring leader and leading from the rear. My wife is Elenius from Iron Isles. It's cool. And we have Theon in here. Still having his uh, all of his body parts, luckily. Uh, now we could take a focus. I think it would be reasonable for me to just focus on war or hunting. I want to live a little bit longer. So I guess hunting for now. And some martial gonna be useful. And ambition. Fall in love, win the war, adopt lifestyle, Valerian sword. Valerian sword is really great. I want to have a Valerian sword, sword at some point. It's actually gonna work. But let's first of all try to... Um, Win the war, it's invasion of Westerlands. What if I were to enforce demands? Become the new Lord Paramount of Westerlands. Oh! That actually... Gonna be tricky. But Lannisters is now gonna be... Gonna be at war with the North, at war with the Stannis Baratheon, and at war with me, so... Yeah, I'm just gonna try to, like, raid them, first of all. And then we'll see what we could do in here. And we could even accept a white piece if needed, so... Shouldn't be too much of a problem. Uh, yeah, so, unmarried heir, who could we marry you to? As I already noticed, looks like uh, the, uh, the guys from Greyjoy family couldn't actually marry to anyone outside of their religion. Looks like, I've already checked like Dorn, and I could not marry you to my son, first of all, because he do not want to marry an infidel. Uh, how about like a whale? What about betrothal between... Oh, you're a boy, <laughs> never mind. Probably don't want to be betrothed to Theon, right? Pentas and other guys does not matter. And the reach... Yeah, looks like it's not gonna work out, okay. So, let's go on and pause. 
Uh, we still have not took the ambition. Win and the war probably gonna be tricky, so I would actually prefer probably to just fall in love for now. So we have a daughter in here, Princess Asha, who is quick and attractive. She is cool. I like her more than uh, the Theon. But okay. And you are accepting my call to arms. Who the heck are you? And why you... Okay, I don't know. Someone's joining on my side, but you're just gonna get slaughtered. So, who could be raising here? You could raise up to 16,000 troops. That's actually pretty great. But we do not need such a huge armies for raiding. So, what I am going to do is... I'm just gonna combine them for now. Let's go and raise all of our bots as well. We have tons of bots too. 300 of them. And we get like... We're gonna get like... I don't know, maybe 2,000 armies for raising parties. All hail his grace, Iron King Balon, the ninth of House Greyjoy, King of Salt and Rock, son of the Sea Wind, Lord Ripper of Pike. Ripper? And protector of the Iron Islands. Yeah, sounds familiar. Uh, we have unlanded sons, that's fine. We have... We need new people in the council. My brother, Aaron Tampair, could become Master of Laws. Why not? And Master of Whisperers, my son. Uh, okay, why not? So, you need to train troops in the capital. You need to scheme in the capital, I guess. Come on, stop clicking on this guy. And you need to like, oh, build zeal. Zeal is raised, or proselytize. Okay, that's interesting. That's actually different. Is there, no, well, is there a religion could provide me with anything interesting? No. Where is their holy sites? Uh, somewhere here. Yeah, yeah. That's, they're pretty much the same. Okay. No, I don't think I want to build zealots. Or could I? Let's try. Ah, oh, this stupid marshal. This stupid island is so small. And you should be collecting taxes. And diplomat just could stay here. We have a new heir. If your character does, he'll play as the Lord Victorian of the... Uh, uh, why is it so? What kind of succession do we have? Ignatic elective. Hmm. Is also widowed. We have... Another one brother who is actually strong and attractive. I would much prefer to play as this one actually. Could I vote for him? I could. Uh, oh, he's currently in the city of Pentos. Do you want to come back to home? Opinion, opinion, close relative, unable to press... I'm unable to press, press your claims? Are you sure? Okay. Mm, I don't think that I, I want you to be my heir then, if you're not gonna be in my court. Actually, if you were to succeed, you would become, you would come back to home, I'm pretty sure. Right? And this one brother, oh, he's also strong, but he's widowed right now. Mm, which one is better? I guess, let's go and take this one for now. Uh, sorry, Theon. You're not gonna become my heir. For now, at least. Or not good enough. Or actually, they're also pretty decent. Oh, it doesn't matter. What we need to do right now is uh, pillage the heck out of we uh, Westerlands. Also, the North Army seems to be crushing for now. There's 31,000 of them. I hope you're not gonna lose this uh, war, isn't dumbass. Okay, 300 boats in there. Mm, what I am going to do is. Try not to forget to loot, to toggle the looters. Let's get you here. Actually... Do I want to loot you, or do I want to try to win this war? Now let's first of all loot them. So it should be... Oh, hello. Hello, Lannisters. What are you doing in here? Guess I, ca I guess we're gonna fight off this army. 
2016, we're going to have a straight cross, unfortunately. Also, leaders. I'm leading middle. Sounds great. This guy. Have a Valyrian sword. I want to have a Valyrian sword too. Okay, my brother on one flank. And light foot. My daughter on the other flank. Sounds great. Mm, there lands some more. It's also heals. Oh, that's really unfortunate. Wall is under assault. Um, you could not protect it right now. I am going to join this war, but I don't think I'm going to help some. Okay, Lannisters, don't you have... You should be able to... Or you should... You're supposed to fight with the north. Not invading me. Mm. I'm supposed to invade you. Oh, well. Let's go and... Destroy some more of your armies. And I think... We're actually not going to be trying to raid you. Or should we? Because if I were to land raiders in here, I don't think I'm going to receive any war score. Could you please stop landing the separate islands? I'm already bored of getting all these trade crossings. Your bannerman is currently under threat of external from external enemies. Yeah, it is my duty, but... I don't think I'm gonna uh, be able to help you much. Okay, stack wiping a lot of Lannister's armies. How many have you left? Oh, 47,000. Yeah, that's a little bit much. But at least we're gonna get enough war score to maybe at least white piece. Yeah, so in case... In case if he gonna decide to land like 60,000 troops on my lands... I'm gonna be able to white peace. Hmm. Also, all of a sudden, Mons is a raider for some reason losing his war. He somehow managed to win a battle. A pretty huge one in here, actually. Okay, he's just gonna be landing on all of my... on all of my islands. Okay. I guess I'm not gonna go and... I'm not gonna go and loot you for now. I'm just try to... Fight off as much battles as possible. Give some more chances to the north to become independent. And just try to... Try not to lose my own war. Yeah, he's definitely focusing on me for some reason. And not his religious war. Well... Could we actually, like... I think I could split off one army from here, like a thousand troops. And let's... Yeah, the raiding party. Should be a decent idea. Not 5,000, it's a little bit too much. But... Something like this? Oh. Like, I don't know, 1,000 troops? Probably enough. Or even 700. In the vanilla game it's actually... 500 should be enough. To get full bonuses. So... Your wife has sent you a small gift. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna accept this puppy. We're gonna call him... Mm, no. Tricky. Because we are tricky. So. Okay, you're, you're going here. You need to defend this. On these boats. On these flags. It's not Lannisters. Hmm... The enemy draws near during the battle, and an uncontrollable rage begins to swell within you. You're fiercely bite down on the edges of your shield and attempt to devour it. Trembling with anger, you then raise your great axe and charge howling into the enemy ranks. My of course attempt to flee. My goodness. I am becoming a berserk. Plus four martial minus two diplomacy. Must kill more. Yeah. Sounds like an awesome trait. Yeah, they're definitely looking like a Vikings in the vanilla game. That's cool. Uh, have I set you to be raiders? I haven't. Okay, let's go and do this before I forget. Again. Uh, raiders. Okay, 700 troops I think should be able to... Should be able to get full bonuses of raising. Oh, they have 4,000 troops in here. That's unfortunate, actually. Uh... It's really convenient 
and they're actually only one C tile away from me. Because I could raid and then just uh, sell my boats like really quickly to home. Okay, let's see how much I'm gonna be able to loot in here. One gold every four day. Four days. And now, maybe it's gonna work. In, uh, whilst they have been embroidered in conflict, we have been riven the lands loyal to a great ruler. They will surely be displeased with this fragrant breach of the laws of their lands. King Joffrey gonna dislike me. Pfft. We are ironborn, we follow our own way, yeah. We do not sow as we already tell or whatever. No, oh, by the way, rich is also yeah. Marguerite is married to King Joffrey or betrothed. So it's helping them. But we still could take land take money from Lannisters. Looks like 700 is actually not enough, or is it? No, just just sit here. Should be fine. Levy reinforcement in the capital. Sounds great. Could we raise any more troops in here? We could re-raise if you want so. 5,000 troops we could raise from somewhere, somewhere else. Okay. Yeah, Lannisters just keep uh, piling armies in here, even though they can do much. They do not have enough boats to land a huge army in here, which is perfectly fine with me. Because I'm receiving war score with each with each of these small battles. Is this guy gonna go to protect his island? That is possible. Yes. Okay. Retreat. Managed to loot 15 gold from you. Not too bad. Hmm... Let's actually go and get some more armies in here. Like up to 2000, I guess, at, uh, at least. So... Yeah, let's give you like 1200 more. We could uh, perfectly defend with 1000. And I forgot to get you as a looter, of course. Set you as a looter. Our dog is growing quickly and it's no longer a little puppy. Thanks. Hmm... Okay, you go on those boats, there's 6,000 troops in here, there's my vassal getting wrecked in the mountains, or maybe not wrecked, maybe he would pull off this battle with defensive bonuses, but I kinda doubt it. How's North doing? Rob, my friend, how do you like me? Not much, do you want actually to get any marriages? Your uh, heir is now Lord Brandon, yeah, your brother. You have green dreams and he is crippled. How about... Or actually, where is Arya? Oh, Arya considered as died. Or I as dead. Possibly only went missing. That's unfortunate. I like Arya. What about Sansa? Oh, Sansa is currently, yeah, in the court of Joffrey. So... We could not do much. Okay, these 2,000 troops need to go somewhere. We could actually also probably just pillage rich as well. Because we're now independent, so we do not care who to pillage, but it's probably gonna be better to just pillage Lannisters, right? Oh, 14,000 more troops in here, God damn it! Why do you have so many? Well, at least I could take some, some stuff from here. Well, you're not gonna pay attention. And destroy some more of your armies. Mm, is it going quicker now? We're getting two gold per four days. Mm, I d I'm not gonna say that it's quicker, but it's something. I should be paying attention to the army. His armies he's gonna be raising. Okay, more battles, and even more battles, up to forty percent. That's great. Now, Lord Ralph of Orkmond has provided me with proof that Lord Summon has been viciously slandering me. Just stay out of factions. Don't care. Excellent. I hope it's not. I hope uh, I'm not gonna force him to leave loyal, Loyalist faction, because it would be terrible. Okay, another one battle in here. Eric is no longer a master of coin. Let's get someone else. 
Don't lead troops. Just collect taxes for me. Are we losing money? We are losing money. Your visions turn red with bloodless and you charge a hit without reg uh, regard for safety. As your nearest companions hurry to keep you up, you surrender to your berserk's rage and your axe cuts a wide swath in the enemy ranks. When the dust settles, they find you standing over half dozen slain foes. Oh my goodness, I'm such a freaking badass. 200 precision, one more marshal. Yeah, I'm definitely a beast. Uh, could you please lose without trade? We need another one guy, or we need you to produce babies if you want to be my heir. Okay, we have 46 ducats in here. I think we could get them back home. Just not to get like bankrupt on, on any chance. Okay, you guys, leave my islands. You do not belong in here. Uh, yeah, let's go and drop the, uh, uh, the money off. Great, some money, some prestige, and let's get back on the boats. And let's see what could, what could be doing here. Oh, also, I have not checked this. 44% in the favor of King Robert is a young wolf. Okay, what about Stannis? How are you doing? 25% in favor of Stannis. Okay, so Iron Throne actually gets wrecked. Surprisingly. Uh, yeah, you on your own do not have much troops, but rich have quite a few. Down to 50,000. 15,000. Probably thanks to me taking attention of Lannisters. They're actually gonna win all of their wars. But then I'm gonna just take it all from them. And, by the way, it's already actually time for me to have a break, guys. So, I'm gonna do this, and we're gonna continue in the next episode. So, if you enjoying this series... Uh, you should definitely leave a like, especially considering that is the first episode in the series. It's definitely gonna help me by quite a lot. And if you have any suggestions, you should leave them in the comments. And if you haven't subscribed to the channel, you should probably do this. And I will see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.